ladies, this is Kat, and I'm coming on to show you all. I wasn't invited. I don't, I'm not that popular here on YouTube just yet, so I wasn't invited to be a part of the collaboration, but I'm like, shoot, I have an idea, and I'd like to share it with the ladies as well. Um, a lot of ladies on here are doing the huge collaboration of $5 upcycle, and I just wanted to show you real quick what I did. Um... Everything I got here except for those two pieces are from the Dollar Tree and everything is everything that I already had in my house except for those two pieces from the um which I got from Hobby Lobby. But let me get into it. I already had these candlesticks as some of you may know. I always I do a lot of events so I already have a whole lot of things in my garage and a while ago well last spring I decided to make these apothe carry jars looking things um, just to put around in my kitchen for decor um, so again you can get these from the Dollar Tree which is where I purchased them um, I already had them and then you can get these candlesticks from the Dollar Tree which is where I also purchased them these I already had them and I also got this moss from the Dollar Tree but again, I already had these um, laying around my house in my garage. So I just decided to hot glue the candlestick to the vase. And these vases are always at um, Hobby Lobby. If you can see that, I just hot glued it to the vase. It's very sturdy. Added the moss. These fake fruit, you can get fake fruit from... The Dollar Tree, the little small ones like this. Um, this is actually some fruit that came in a gift basket that I got. I just recycle, upcycle those as well. Now, as far as this is concerned, I got these from Hobby Lobby. The bottom circle piece was 79 cents, and as well as so was this top spindle. And I sprayed it. You can spray it whatever color you like. Now, one thing I did want to show you is my lids are different <clears throat> because I didn't know which way I wanted to do them. They come with like a lip on them. So you can either just sit it on top like that. You know, the lip, the lip have the lip up. My husband's, I put a screw in it. That's how I screwed the spindles to. My husband drew me a little thing. But you can also hot glue this to that if you wanted to. Um, and then the other one, I put the lip down going inside of the inside of the actual jar. Let me sit it on there right. And so there you have it, a little decor. You can use these in your bathroom and put cotton balls and uh, Q-tips in them. You can put display soaps. You can um, use them on your vanities to put hair, uh, hair clips and different things in them. You can put uh, um, your brushes for your makeup. Um, like I said, I use them around my kitchen. I have a lot of counter space in my kitchen, so I use them just for a little decor. Sometimes they're up above the kitchen cabinet for decor. Right now they're sitting on the cat, uh, countertop. I may use them for something else that's coming fall. Um, <clears throat> something else you can do is you can actually spray the bottom, the glass on the bottom, to whatever color, like if you want to spray it white to match the white on the top, you could do that. I'm actually thinking of spraying this part yellow and then the bottom part yellow just so it matches my kitchen, like that mustard yellow color. You could do whatever you want. The possibilities are endless. I just wanted to be a part of this little quick little collaboration that everyone is doing. Um, this I just wanted to show you how I use Dollar Tree all the time everywhere, and you can upcycle this. The possibilities are Endless ladies, as always, be good to yourself and others. Be blessed.